The American dream took root hundreds of years ago in Europe. Once the discoveries of Christopher Columbus and other explorers were published, Europeans began to romanticize this new world, and many of them were convinced to make the difficult journey across the Atlantic Ocean. Among the earliest American settlers was John Smith, who once governed the Virginia settlement at Jamestown. Smith saw America as a new Eden, and as a place where fortunes could be made and empires built. No matter how difficult the actual experience was, John Smith helped keep the dream alive by reporting to Europe accounts such as these. Here nature and liberty afford us that freely which in England we want, or it costs us dearly. If a man work but three days in seven, he may get more than he can spend, unless he will be excessive. While many like John Smith came to seek their fortunes, many others came in pursuit of different dreams. The Puritans, for example, were the victims of political and religious persecution in Europe. They came to America in order to practice their religion in peace and to make an example of themselves to the world. The Puritans dreamed of creating a model city, and through great effort and perseverance, they realized some parts of that dream. But from the beginning, the American dream contained contradictions. The early explorers and settlers came looking for land, treasures, and freedom. But what they gained often came at the expense of Native Americans. As more Europeans came to this continent, Native Americans were pushed off the land they had lived on for centuries, the beginning of a tragic pattern that would continue for over 300 years.